What's up, everybody? It's Counter HD here, bringing us a brand new video today. We'll be doing a Madden tier list of all the ultimate teams and where I personally think they should be. With that being said, let's just hop right into it. We're going to start from oldest to and work our way up. So, we're going to start with Madden 25 first. All right, Madden 25, it was a good game. Anyway, decent. It was the first game on Xbox One. And 360 is cross uh, cross platform time, so ah uh, personally I got I gotta put this B tier. I enjoyed it. It it was like one of my first Ultimate Team games, which was like really fun, and it's kind of what got me into Ultimate Team as a whole. So I did actually really enjoy it, and yeah. So, we got that one at B. Next up, we got 15. 15? It was... A, 15 was a really good game. This is before Madden started getting pretty bad. So, yeah, this was like prime Madden time. So, 15, easily A. A. It was just... It was just a fresh Madden game. Even, even though it's the same thing every year, it was fresh. Um, it's, there's no easy way to describe that, but yeah. It was a fresh and really good Madden game. So, next up we got Madden 16. Let's just go ahead and move that up there really fast. Easily the best Madden. Easily the best Madden of all time. Okay, it brought draft champs, which it was cool then. Now it kind of sucks, but that it was really cool then. They brought a bunch of new features that was awesome, okay? And it was hands down just the best game we've gotten that was like worth our money easily so I gotta put that one at S next up we got Madden 17 this is where Madden started to dip down in Madden 17 it was a good game but it still had its rough edges and patches so it was really the first like down Madden Ever since the uh, these three I have up already, and it, it just kind of felt like a copy and paste, just like with a little different. And I I didn't like that. I know others didn't like that. So Madden 17, I'll put that one in D tier. Next up, we got Madden 18. Madden 18 is is an interesting game. Okay, it, it was, it's, I mean, it's Madden, okay, you can't really get much different, but it was always cool, I, I always enjoy Madden, but this one also felt like just another, another falling point, and I, I don't know, I don't know, personally, it's just, it's, they just went on downward spiral, spiral from 16, and I don't know, it just never came back, so personally, I still, Got Madden 18 at F tier. And then last but not least, Madden 19. Madden 19, it was an interesting game. Interesting cover athlete too. With Antonio Brown. I I enjoyed Madden 19. It's just... I didn't... I don't think the game was, lived up to its full potential. Because a lot of times with these Madden games, they'll hold back... Okay, they could be doing more. They could have like more promos. They could be putting more of that effort. A lot of the times, they could be doing that, but instead, they just don't. And it, it truly makes no sense to me or the Madden community. It's just it always feels like they're trying to be lazy and just trying to money grab most of the time. So yeah, but I don't know. It's Madden. Madden 19, I, I don't really feel like the effort was there, but it definitely wasn't worse than Madden 18. So, I, I think it's got to go up there with Madden 17 and D's here. Uh, and that's it, because I cannot find one with um, uh, Madden 20 and Madden 21, which both those would be DC tier. But yeah, um, that's going to conclude it though. If you enjoyed this, 
and you want to see me make more tier lists, hit that like button, comment, subscribe. With that being said, I'll see y'all in the next one. Uh, out, fourth quarter shorty, no call outs. Don't go to work, baby, just call out. Uh, in the bedroom, all uh, out. Perks on the counter, I can't wait to take them. Blunts on the counter, can't wait to face it. Bad little bitch, yeah, she be my favorite. All my songs, they all on her playlist. I don't really know how to say it, but I'ma say it. I don't really know if she take it, but she can take it. I don't slow it down unless I'm in the matrix. Presidential brain, that bitch like Sarah Palin.